Hey guys, Two Dogs here, and I want to do a quick uh, discussion, more than it is a review, of something that I just received from Clinger Holsters. Uh, yep, love the slogan, I cling to my God-given rights. But I got an email, and flattery always works with me. We've recently noticed your work in the gun industry. You are quite talented and creating high quality content. Thank you very much from Kyla, Kayla, Kyla, Kayla, K-Y-L-A-H, customer service. Okay, well, I've got an email. But what does Klinger do? Well, they make holsters. Really? This is not a review of a holster. Thank God. This is something else. And we're gonna take a look at it right now. So everybody knows Klinger makes holsters. I've done reviews, good and bad. I am very open and honest. And um, Kyla said, hey, we have something that we're doing. If you don't wanna use our holster for whatever reason, fine. But we've got something, an accessory that might benefit um, the holster you are using. And this is basically a cushion, a Klinger cushion. So it's a cushion that goes over the top of the part of the holster inside the waistband, part of the holster that rides up against your skin. Now, as all of you know, I'm Huntsville Hunter now, moved to Huntsville, Alabama, and in the summertime, which is like half the year, it gets hot. And as much as I love holsters like this, that's a lot of real estate on my skin with shorts. There's just a lot there. Yeah, it feels great, but it feels like I, you know, it's like I'm walking around with a purse tucked in my waist. So one of the things I like is a Kydex holster, inside, outside the waistband, whatever it may be. I just love that holster itself. So one of the things I've realized is that I this this Kydex rubbing against your skin is no bueno. Okay, and so they said, okay, fine. You want to use someone else's holster? Great. What we're going to do is we're going to offer you a cushion. And basically, they give you step-by-step -step tutorial on how to do this, how to install it. And it's not even really an install. So it's a pad, neoprene pad on one end. This is the part that touches your skin. And on the other side is one half of Velcro, right? The, the tough part of the Velcro. And then they give you little discs. You can buy these if you need more. Um, and then alcohol pad. And you basically are gonna strategically put these discs on the parts of your holster that you want. I mean, literally, here's a remora. Remora's gone to this whole inside tuckable, but this hurts, man, this is not soft. I love the remora concept, but it's not soft. So one of the things I might do is just take my pad, stick it right there, and wear it that way. Right, and just Velcro's right on. And this is adjustable in size. These come in different sizes. I told them the kind of firearm that I carry, as you all know, 43X. And I thought, okay, well this is the size for that, for this, uh, for basically any holster that goes on there. This is the size, guns unloaded, knock it off. Fingers not on the trigger, chill. But it basically is like that. In a nutshell, that's how it works. Boy, wouldn't that be cool? Here's an idea, Klinger. There's your next holster. Boom, give me something to hold that sucker in there. Slide in the pant, I'm done. Right, just a nice thin Kydex right there with this pad on this side. That's all I need in the south. But anyway, I thought I would open this up for discussion. I'm not gonna try it on or anything. Basically, you guys get the idea. You know, it sticks on the back of any one of these. Obviously not that, but you know, if I have a Kydex, let's pretend this is inside, and I wanna stick it on there. Thin strip up, boom, I put it on, I tuck it inside my pant, and away we go. And it's not that thick either, so it's not gonna add a lot of bulk to the inside of your pants. That's it right there. But this is soft. This is extremely soft, as some of their holsters are um, with, with the Velcro. So just thought I'd share that with you. Thanks, Kyla, for sending it on. Um, it's freezing here, so <laughs> I'll wear this this summer and let you guys know how it goes. But any comments are much appreciated. So if you're interested in picking one of these up, check them out, cleanerholsters.com.